As a veteran, I know firsthand the importance of standing up for injustice when we see it. And one of my favorite trainings at the National Conflict Resolution Center is called the Bystander Challenge. In the Bystander Challenge, we talk about moving from becoming a bystander to becoming an upstander. In the post-pandemic world, with all the changing rules and regulations, we all have different comfort levels. As we go back to work and we begin going to in-person social events, we all feel a little bit differently and that's perfectly normal and okay. But what we wanna do is if we see a microaggression or a slight related to that, we wanna make sure to address it head on. A lot of times, some of the reasons that we don't wanna do that is we don't know exactly what to say. We don't know how to address it and we don't wanna be seen as that person that always gets involved. But unfortunately, when we see something and don't say it, it makes it seem like what we saw was okay and it sets a precedence for the future. During the bystander challenge, one of the things we talk about is to make sure to address issues head on, to approach it respectfully, and to make a plan for the future. So we hope that with these tips, you can move from becoming a bystander to becoming an upstander.